parents are both musicians. My father is a composer, my mother is a mezzo-soprano, and I was taught all kinds of musical things from an early age. I took lessons in theory, composition, and, and piano. I think it was a way for my father to punish his students. They got assigned to giving me theory lessons. When I was a young teen, I had a bit of a rebellious period. I told my parents that I wanted to quit the piano. I wanted to do something else, and I picked the cello. I know my parents think that's pretty funny. Playing the cello doesn't seem much like a rebellion. And one of the reasons why I liked the cello so much was because of this calendar I had in my room. It was a musician's calendar, each month representing a famous performer. And March, my birth month, uh, had Rostropovich, uh, the great legendary cellist. A big black and white photo of him playing the cello, uh, looking very serious. And I really, really liked that image. After finishing my degree, which took a long time because it was my doctorate degree, I won a few local auditions, all the Philharmonic, uh, with whom I'm still the principal cellist, Colorado Ballet, Opera Colorado, Central City Opera. These are wonderful performing organizations. So why come to MSU Denver to study music? In order to answer that effectively, I think first we have to consider why go anywhere and study music? And I think several things are very important. First, I can think of the skills required to be a musician. You have to have the skills to get around your instrument and be a competent performer. You also need knowledge. We're dealing with music and, and, and something that is steeped in history and tradition. There are a lot of people who's been at this business, honing it and perfecting it for many generations. One has to have a perspective in order to be successful using those skills properly in proper context. So, you know, musicology, theory, history, uh, the knowledge part is very, very important to become a successful musician and a successful person. Skill and knowledge alone will not help you become a competent artist and a great musician. You have to have the temperament. You have to have been tested in order to survive uh, the weight of this profound and great art. So, can a school provide these things? In order for you to have skills, you need instructors. MSU Denver has fantastic instructors who are not only skillful in their craft, but they are also tested. They are the leading professionals in the region. We have members of the Colorado Symphony, and ballet, opera houses, uh, recording engineers, and even freelancers, music entrepreneurship organizers and, and coaches. Our faculty are people who are out there, outside the school, busy having a musical career, and they bring first-hand knowledge of their craft into the school, which is very valuable. And I think at MSU Denver, it's a particularly noticeable thing. So the faculty, a great asset to any student. And our academic faculty, our, our history and theory musicology faculty, they are very well experienced. They've seen it all. You won't be able to trick them into giving you a good grade without doing hard work. They are experienced and dedicated pedagogues. So the faculty uh, in the skills and the uh, knowledge department is really second to none. Because MSU is so centrally located in the middle of Denver, just across the street from the Denver Performance Arts Center, and because we have such professionals working here, it is uniquely poised to deal with this issue of the proper temperament required of a musician uh, in a high level. What I like uh, the best, I could describe it as a campus culture at MSU Denver Music Program. I'm encouraged and allowed and supported by the department and other faculty to push my students to a very high level. We have a lot of interaction you know, in the classroom and, and, and in the lessons, as well as uh, advising sessions, you know, uh, sometimes uh, speaking over a cup of coffee. Uh, we have a kind of a friendly culture uh, that allows interactions not only as faculty and students, but also as fellow humans pursuing art and music. And this is a very important thing. And I think I noticed that more here. It's one of those things that I liked uh, a lot about MSU Denver, that we have this culture of encouragement, but also pushing each other hard. My name is Charles Lee. I am a cellist and the cello instructor here at MSU Denver Music Program. Thank you.